um, nag-precut na ako ng, nag-slice na ako ng strawberries. So, susundan ko lang yung nasa cookbook. Kasi nga, syempre, um, American dessert to. So, hindi ko siya knows. Hi guys! Welcome back to my channel. So, today, um, gawa lang tayo ng all-American dessert, which is yung strawberry shortcake. So, sobrang simple lang nung um, paggawa nito, tsaka yun ng ingredients. So, kailangan nyo lang ng maraming 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 strawberries. And since in-season na ang strawberries dito, so medyo matamis na sila, so gagawa kami ng strawberry shortcake. Actually, ang gagawin dapat namin today is s'mores, kaso nga ang init na dito sa Arizona. So, hindi namin, hindi mo muna kami maglalabas ng fire pit para hindi masyado mainit. So, tara, samahan nyo ako. Okay, let's do it. Yan, so according kay Betty Crocker's cookbook, page 179, kailangan natin ng 1 quart na fresh strawberries. So, pinrikat ko na ito, slice ko na yan. And then, kailangan nyo ng 1 cup of sugar. Isisprinkle nyo lang siya sa ibabaw. Pero, ang ginawa namin is half a cup of sugar lang kasi ayaw namin na masyadong matamis. So, huwag nyo siyang kahaluin kasi haya na natin itong mag-syrup mamaya. Yan, so hindi ko alam yung talagang um, ingredients niya by memory. So, susundan lang natin yung cookbook nila dito. So, nag-pre-slice ako ng strawberries. And then, kailangan nyo ng um, one quart na strawberry sliced. And then, um, one cup of white sugar. So, depende sa inyo yun. Um, kami ginawa lang namin half a cup. Kasi ayaw namin ng sobrang tamis. Kasi gagawa rin kami ng um, kailangan din namin ng whipped cream. Yan, so, kuha lang tayo ng bowl and then kuha tayo ng 2 cups of all-purpose flour. And then, kailangan nyo ng um, 2 tablespoons of white sugar. And then, kailangan nyo ng 3 teaspoons of baking powder. And then, kailangan nyo din ng 1 teaspoon salt. And make sure na i-incorporate nyo muna mabuti lahat ng dry ingredients nyo bago nyo ilagay yung wet ingredients. So, next naman natin is 1 third of a cup of butter. So, ang maganda dito guys, yung butter nila mayroon na talaga silang tanda kung saan mo pwede hiwain yung butter. So, hindi mo na kailangan magtansya-tansya. So, hiwain ko lang to sa cubes ng butter bago ko siya ilagay dito sa flour mixture. Kasi, ang gagawin natin, kakuha tayo ng dough kneader. Tapos, yun yung ipanghahalo natin together with our dry ingredients. And so, paghaluin nyo lang mabuti yung butter nyo and yung flour mixture nyo. And then, hanggang maging sandy na yung texture nya. Kuha kayo ng 1 cup of milk. I do suggest na i-pour over nyo siya dun sa flour um, mixture nyo half a cup at a time. So, medyo messy to. So, konting tiyaga lang. And then, once tapos na kayo, na feel nyo lang na napag-incorporate nyo na yung dry and wet ingredients nyo, kuha lang kayo ng spatula. And then, haluin lang natin to bago natin siya i-transfer sa 8 by 1 and a half pan. So, kuha kayo ng vegetable spray. If ever na wala kayong vegetable spray, okay lang yon. Kahit anong oil na meron kayo, um, pahiran nyo lang yung pan nyo. Or kahit butter. Kasi medyo... Ano to, medyo sticky itong texture ng butter natin. So, pag hindi natin ito nilagyan ng, um, ng extra layer of yung spray sa pan, may tendency na dumikit to. Yan. So, i-flatten lang natin yung butter. So, it doesn't need to be perfect as long as kahit pa paano mapag-ano nyo yung all sides. And once okay na kayo, ilagay na natin siya sa oven. So, this time, gagamit ako ng countertop na oven kasi mainit ngayon. So, kailangan nyo i-preheat or i-heat yung um, oven nyo ng 450 degrees Fahrenheit for 20 minutes. So, itong strawberry, sayaan lang natin to. Um, gagamitin natin to later pa. Yeah. 
Ayan, so once nag-beep na yung oven nyo, cancel nyo lang. And then, kunin na natin tong ating shortcake. So, maganda yung pagkaka-bake natin kasi yung top niya, brown. So, ganito yung itsura ng shortcake. So, kung wala kayo malinis sa toothpick, and then, um, tingnan nyo lang bawat sides. Kapag malinis na lumabas yung toothpick nyo, ibig sabihin, lutong mabuti yung shortcake nyo. So, next naman natin is yung whipped cream. Um, kumuha lang ako ng 1 cup. And then, i-whip lang natin to hanggang magkaroon siya ng stiff peak. So, usually kasi nilalagay is whipped cream kasama ng strawberry shortcake. And then, yung iba naman, ang nilalagay is vanilla ice cream. Ng 1 teaspoon of sugar yung whipped cream kasi gusto namin may lasso pa rin yung whipped cream kahit pa pano. So, sa every time nagwagawa ko ng whipped cream, lagi ko siya nilalagay ng 1 teaspoon of sugar. And so, I suggest na gawin nyo to sa sink para kahit magtalsikan siya, madali siyang linisin. Then, hintayin lang natin siya na maging stiff peak. So, kapag tinaob nyo yung bowl nyo at hindi nalaglag yung whipped cream nyo, it means na buo na ang inyong whipped cream. And so, assemble naman natin siya. So, ikat nyo lang into squares yung shortcake nyo. And then, hiwain nyo sa gitna. So, ang mangyayari nito is para siyang layered cake. So, shortcake. Tapos ilalagay natin yung um, strawberries and then yung whipped cream. And then another layer of um, shortcake and then strawberries and then whipped cream and then strawberries. First time making that, right, Emma? It is. Look what she did. Wow. I know. Wow is right. Wow is right, Abby. <laughs> you made whipped cream from scratch. She did the strawberries. She did the shortcake. I think the shortcake turned out perfect. It's not overdone at all. It's perfect. Thanks, Dad. That's my first time. And syempre, as usual, always taste test kung ano yung ginawa nyo. So, in fairness dito, para siyang ref cake na hindi ni ref cake. So, layered cake lang din talaga siya. Pero in fairness sa kanya, masarap kasi hindi siya ganun katamis. Ang light lang nung lasa niya. Ayan, so what can you say about the strawberry shortcake? What? What can you say about the strawberry <laughs> Okay, so that's all for today, guys. So, sobrang easy lang niya gawin. So, um, hopefully, nang gusto niyong vlog nito, please don't forget to like and share and subscribe and hit the notification bell if you would like to be notified every time you upload a new vlog. So, till next time, guys. Bye. Bye.